My name's Tony Gimignani, owner of Tony's Pizza Napolitana in San Francisco, and these are the slices of my life. So we're making a uh, margarita, so it's hand stretching it like that. So you're really light on this dough. San Marzano tomatoes, there's really barely any seeds in this. Local, we source basil here. We're gonna hand pinch, grande mozzarella. A little sea salt, olive oil. And let the fun begin. Uh, I always cook, don't get me wrong. It wasn't just acrobat, that's just all he did. While I was doing the acrobatics, it just wasn't tossing. I was working actually with chefs in their restaurants. I was practicing Neapolitan and I said, you know what, I'm gonna enter the World Pizza Cup. I heard it's coming and it's gonna be in Naples. Remember, Naples is in a world of its own. It's a birthplace of pizza. So I went there with a small group of Americans and I competed. I'm going in, all these cameras, America's here, and they're filming Rye and TV, everyone's filming. I have all these cameras behind me and you're in this oven. So I cut the pizzas, give it to the judges, you hope they like it. Okay, I did the best I could. So the awards come around, we have a small table, 2,000 people in this arena. So all of a sudden they say, up next, STG, Pizza Napolitana. Uh, third place goes to Seconde, you know, second place goes to, and man's all, and I are all, we didn't win. And uh, they said, first place goes to, and they pause and police come to our table. And they come in and they put their backs to our table like that. And there's an uh, Italian guy, uh, Enrico Fama, head of the Pizza and Pasta magazine at that time spoke English, and as they said my name, he said, don't get excited. He literally said that as we go up, and they said, from Castro Valley, California. It was a pinnacle moment in the pizza industry. Uh, America won in Naples. Uh, it was like winning in wine in France. That was the cup that I won that, uh, when I was escorted out by the police, um, this is the one that I was holding in action. 90% of everybody in that whole arena hated me. <laughs> but uh, yeah, at that moment in time, I, I, you can say I guess I was the best. <laughs>